Sometimes you can't finish a job and have to leave it outside for a while. This panel was primed with regular lacquer primer surfacer and while I'm waiting on some parts we'll leave it outside for a month or two and see if it causes any major problems. The TV, internet, and magazines will generate scary stories of rust to make you buy products you don't really need. One of those stories is body filler is porous or lacquer primer is porous and they absorb moisture and unless you use epoxy primer your project will be ruined. Today we're going to prove that to be wrong. We actually left this project outside for a lot longer than two months, almost one year, 11 months to be exact. And here's what really happens. We'll wipe this clean so we can really get a good look at it. Up close it looks completely fine, no signs of rust except for this right here and let me give you a close-up shot of that. Here's a close-up shot of that hole and the rust probably formed because there is very little primer on the edges of that hole. And in case you're thinking there may be some rust underneath the primer or underneath the filler, we'll block sand this like normal, DA sand it and see if anything shows up. We hit it first with some spray bomb black and now we're going to block sand it with some 120 grit on a medium board and some 220 grit on a DA. After block sanding, this is what it looks like. Here's a close-up shot of the bare metal spots. As you can see, you don't have to be afraid to leave something outside for a while in primer. And even if we remove the primer and filler with thinner, or stripper, you'd still be fine. I hope you enjoyed this video on disproving stories of fillers and primers other than epoxy primer absorbing moisture and causing rust. If you did and you'd like to get my latest videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button.